How to configure an Airport Express so its sole responsibility is to airplay. The Airport Express has been set back to factory settings. You can see other options is grayed out right now, but that's what we want to click. Add to an existing network. I'm going to name my base station Airplay Speakers, and then you can extend it from whichever other base station you'd like. Setup is complete. The airplay speakers turn green. The dotted line means the base station is connected over Wi-Fi. Checking out the settings. In wireless, we want the network mode to be join a wireless network. Ensure airplay is enabled. Then plug it in and click on a song. But how do you set up a router so it works with AirPlay in an area that you don't have the internet, like a garage, gym, or your gazebo? Well, this is a Airport Express, but a second generation. We'll plug it into the Bose, the powered speakers. After I push the button to reset it to the factory setting, it shows up on our Airport Utility as a device that we can set up. We're going to give it a name. Click other options instead of next. Now we want to create a new network. We'll change the network name. It can sense that it doesn't have the internet. We're just going to continue past that stage. We're just going to keep going even though there's no internet. Setup's complete. You can see there's no internet associated with uh, base station. Uh, no ethernet cable, no internet connection, no DNS server. And pull up iTunes again. The song going. So, uh, iTunes has found the base station. Strange victory.